Hi guys, my name is Amish Tripathi and I am the director of uh, the Nehru Center. The Nehru Center is the cultural wing of the Indian High Commission uh, in the UK and we uh, we have been in existence for many decades and we organize wonderful events at this very auditorium uh, which is in Mayfair in central London. Sadly as you can see the auditorium is empty. It has been empty uh, since we were all uh, put into lockdown uh, due to the coronavirus uh, pandemic. uh but what we indians believe is that the other side of a crisis is an opportunity and what we have done at the nehru center is moved all our events online so now if you attend our online events every single seat is a vip seat like you get a front row uh, at our events no trouble of parking no trouble of traveling all the way uh and most practically all the programs that we would do like uh literary discussions and then and the dance performances musical performances we are doing them all uh, on our online uh, channels you can register at uh, for our newsletter at our uh, website uh, nehrucenter.org.uk you don't need to write them down they will be displayed at the bottom of the screen you can also come to our uh, facebook page which is a verified page the nehru center you can follow uh, updates on all our events on uh, twitter as well the nehru center that's also a verified account or you can come to our youtube channel again the nehru center we are uh, nothing if not consistent uh, i hope you do uh, come to our online channels and enjoy uh, the events that we are putting up for you uh, thank you so much for all your love and support namaste jai hind জয় গুরু শঙ্কর সর্বগুণা কর জাকির নাহিকে উপায় দুহারী চরণে রেণুহত কুটি পার গোপনা ওয়েলকাম টু দ্য টুডেজ প্রোগ্রাম টুডেজ প্রোগ্রাম ইজ বিট ইউনিক উই হ্যাভ নট ডান বিফোর উই আর ট্রাইং টু টু দ্য প্রোগ্রাম উইথ মহাপুরুষ শঙ্কর দেব কন্ট্রিবিউশন টু দ্য আসামিজ সোসাইটি টু দ্য এডুকেশন কালচার এন্ড অফ কোর্স দ্য সোশ্যাল um today's we'll have some ex- a couple of experts uh, dr malika kandali and okay, my guru sri ramkrishna talukdar sir top of that you will be seeing today beautiful hot jay dance choreographed by my guru dipjyoti dipankar and ramkrishna talukdar sir and of course bobby rani talukdar so today's intention is to give you um bit of a kind of information about my beautiful assam uh culture we have got the beautiful dance form called hotria which is a eight form uh, of classical dance of india many of you probably have seen it uh, but this will be good for the people who hasn't seen it also and whoever seen it they will also enjoy this choreography done by my gurus and uh, even in fact i am also going to perform i'm starting the program with a krishna bandana choreographed by dipjyoti dipankar who my guru whom i'm learning from um and uh, and there is another um interesting uh, performance will be borgit which will be done by dr dizin borwa who lives in uh swanzi and he's a by profession he's a doctor he's also a he's also a secretary of assam association in k where i am involved too um so this program is um of course um in association with um litporia nasuni and yes you get and noni kansan kolamonjuri which is my guru's um dance school in guwahati so sit back relax and after you see after you finish this program please give us feedback um how we have done it uh, do you do we need to do more of it we'll definitely try to do another hotria program with seriously beautiful dances and elegant dances um and uh, yes we would be we would love to be involved with um other uh, classical forms which are uh, people are aware of it in uk or around the world so thank you very much for today's presence and um, enjoy the program thank you namaskar
ಕೃಷ್ಣಾ ನಮ ನಮಸ್ಕಾರ ಶ್ರೀಮಂತ ಹಂಕರ್ದೇವ್ ದ ಗ್ರೇಟ್ ಫಾಕ್ಟಿ ಸೆಂಟ್ ಸೋಶಿಯಲ್ ರಿಫಾರ್ಮ ಇಂಟ್ರೊಡ್ಯೂಸರ್ ಆಫ್ ಅಸಮಿಸ್ ವೈಷ್ಣವಿಸಮ್ ಕ್ರಿಯೇಟರ್ ಆಫ್ ಪರ್ಫಾರ್ಮಿಂಗ್ ಆರ್ಟ್ಸ್ ಎಕ್ಸೆಟ್ರಾ ಎಕ್ಸೆಟ್ರಾ ವಾಸ್ ಬಾರ್ನ್ ಎಟ್ ಫಿಫ್ಟೀನ್ ಸೆಂಚುರಿ ಅಸ್ಸಾಂ ಶ್ರೀಮಂತ ಹಂಕರ್ದೇವ್ ಇಸ್ ಎ ಸೇಂಟ್ ಆಫ್ ಫರ್ಸಿಟೈಲ್ ಅಬಿಲಿಟೀಸ್ who had contributed in various field like culture education environment etc shrimanta hankardev had given an unique identity to the assamese people and assamese society the hotel institution means the bushnaba monastery is one of the major contributions of shrimanta hankardev in hotel institution the devotees live and they learn many things they learn hotriya dance borgit the raga based devotional songs they omkianat bushnaba theaters and they learn many texts many traditional texts many ancient indian texts and those texts 
which are introduced by Sri Mantra Hongkode and Sri Sri Madhavde. Namkhar is another contribution of Sri Mantra Hongkode. Namkhar is not only a prayer hall, it is a community hall also. In this community hall, general people can discuss anything. They can discuss, they can do various activities also. Matiakura. Matiakura is another very important contribution of Sri Mantra Hongkode to Asian society. Matiakura means the ground exercise. This ground exercise is a foundation or a grammar of Hotriya dance. But it is very essential for everyone because in Matiakura we can observe some yogi bhangis. Because Yuvanta Hongkode was expert in Yuga Sastra. He was not only an uh, expert in theoretical but in practical field also. And in Matiakura, there are lots of joking for his. So Matiakura is not essential only for the dancers, but it is essential for the general people also. So Matiakura is a unique uh, yoga system which was introduced by Sri Mantra Hongkorte. Sri Mantra Hongkorte was an environmentalist also. Through his various texts, we observe he describes about the nature and how the nature is deeply attached with the human being. Through the Hotria dance, which is introduced by Sri Mantahong Gode, we observe that there are various aspects which are needed for the human being. For example, Hotria dance we, you, we can use as a therapy because we know that dance therapy is very important in this present world. So, when we minutely study all the various activities, various creations of Sri Mantra Hongkode and his main disciple Sri Sri Madhavde, then we realize that these two Bhakti saint had contributed lots of things to the Assamese society and the Assamese people. So we can say the Sri Mantra Hongkari and Sri Sri Madhavde, these two Bhakti saints had given an unique identity to the Assamese people and Asana's society. Namaskar. Before I say anything about Borgit, I must mention two names that were the most important figures in the cultural and religious history of Assam. Sri Mantra Sankardev, who was born in 1449 and died in 1568, was the 15th-16th century Assamese polymath, a saint scholar, poet, playwright, socio-religious reformer, and his most prominent disciple, Madhavdev, who was born in 1489 and, was, and he died in 1596. Madhavdev was an important preceptor of the Akasarana Dharma, known for his loyalty to his guru. Sri Sakadev, as well as his artistic brilliance, he became the religious as well as the artistic successor of Sankardev after the latter's death in 1568. Borgits are the collection of lyrical songs that are set to specific ragas, but not necessarily to any tala. 
These songs, composed by Sri Manto Sankar Dev and Madhav Dev in the 15th, 16th centuries, are used to begin prayer services in the monasteries, as for example, Sotra or Namghara, associated with the Ekasarana Dharma. The first Borgit, Mana Meri Rama Karanahi Lagu, was composed by Sankar Dev during his first pilgrimage in 1488. The Borgits are written in the Poda form of the verse. The first Poda marked the frame and is repeated over the course of singing of the su succeeding verses. In the last couplet, the name of the poet is generally mentioned. The language Sankar Dev used for all his Borgits is Brazavali, an artificial Maithili Assamese mix, though Madhav Dev used Brazavali very sparingly. Sankardev composed about 240 Borgits, but a fire destroyed them all, and only about 34 of them could be retrieved from memory. Sankardev, much saddened by this sad loss, gave up writing Borgits and asked Mother Dev to write them instead. Madhav Dev composed more than 240 Borgits, which focus mainly on the child Krishna. The music of Borgits is based on ragas, which are clearly mentioned. The rhythm or tala, on the other hand, are not mentioned and Borgits need not be set to rhythm. The strict rules that are associated with Borgits and still practiced in Sotras are not followed in popular renderings. This is what I would like to say about Borgit. Thank you very much. Gopale ki goti koile gopinde ki moti dile Gopale ki goti koile gopinde ki Horai lo se tono huri, 
no janu ki mote turi gunite no god bhoilo jiyo lobho moho du bagho hoto te no saro lago ragu ragu e khona ki bo e gobinde ki himuti dile go pale ki goti koi le gobinde ki himuti dile Polai te ne de ke hondi, di ne di ne dri ho bondi. Polai te ne de ke hondi, di ne di ne dri ho bondi. Bolu mondo monero juguti. Tua hori lago kuro, moro maya pa hosuro, hong koro koro yo kakuti e gubinde kimuti dile. Go pale ki go ti koi le go binde ki mu ti ti le na to bi phole po yo ho ho mo geli re go binde ki mu ti ti le. Go pale ki go ti koi le go binde ki mu ti di le ki mu ti di le ki mu ti di le. Namaskar. I am Dipankar Arandhara. I am a Khatriya artist. My family is all into art and culture, which inspired me to be a Khatriya dancer. And my whole life is dedicated to Khatriya dance. Hello everyone. I am Deep Jyoti. I was fascinated by the beautiful art from Satriya the great creation of Mahapuru Sri Manta Shankar Dev from very young age. And since then I am learning, dancing and teaching. Now I have fully dedicated to this art form. We both are dancing together for years. We have an institute called Manikansam Kalamanjuri. In Guwahati, we have students from Canada, US, Fiji, UAE, and UK. We are also an panel artist from ICCR, and recently we have completed a choreography and performance for ICCR in Guwahati. We achieved many awards for hot chair performances, and we are also graded artists from Durasan. Our aim is to take this beautiful, elegant, eight form of classical dance of India to the global audience. We hope everyone around the world knows about this 500 years dance traditions of Assam and also learn and perform like other classical dance form. The journey is now started from the reputed Nehru Center, UK. Hopefully, when everything becomes normal, we will be performing at the Nehru Center itself. Today, our students and we performing three different fields of Khatriya dance. 
that first performance is Kutrodhari Nitya. Kutrodhar is a main character of Ankhya Nata, written by the great Vaisnava saint Mahapuru Srimanta Kankari. He used Kutrodhar to introduce different characters and also express the unplayable part of an Ankhya Nata. Today, we present only some dance part of the Kutrodhar. The dance which is the Kutrodhar takes entry in the Ankhya Nath is called Kutradhari Nritya. It is a pure dance of Khatriya dance form. The second piece of dance is Raghunatha Saranam. Raghunatha Saranam is an Abhinaya based on the Bargi Huna Huna Re Hura written by the great Vaisnava Saint Srimanta Hankadev. Through this composition, you will be shown Setubandhan and Ravanbad. Uh, the last but not the least is Moksha, which will be performing by our very talented students Vipandita, Tina, Hiru, Himasri, Simasri, Kushi, Pritam, and Intelinas. Moksha. This presentation has been based on the players entitled Brahma Adhikari Zibazata, who is in an extract from the Nam Guha written by Mahapur Srimanta Madhavdev. In this universe, every element, including the celestial inhibitions like Brahma, himself are imprisoned behind the bars of illusion. In this piece, the narrator says, O oh Lord, we are unconscious. Service us. Save us like the way you saved Gajendra from Graha. Light up own path towards peace and help us to attain moksha. The three pieces are choreographed by us, Vinsuti and Dipankar. We hope you all enjoy this beautiful art form of Assam and spread the world around. Thank, Thank you very, very much. much. Namaskar. Namaskar. Hey, hit, 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 hit,
इस सभा में उपस्थित समूह कलाकार और दर्शक गण को मेरा हार्दिक स्वागत है आई एम रियली थैंकफुल टू द हाई कमिश्नर ऑफ इंडिया टू यूके एंड द डायरेक्टर ऑफ नेहरू सेंटर फॉर गिविंग मी दिस प्लेटफॉर्म टू स्पीक ए फ्यू लाइन्स अबाउट हॉट डांस ऑफ असम शुरू करने से पहले जिस गुरु का श्री शरण में मैं शिक्षा और आशीर्वाद लेकर आज मैं आप लोगों का सामने खड़ा रहा हूं इस समस्त गुरु को मैं इसी क्षण सहृदय नमन करता हूं एक वंदना के माध्यम से गुरुर् ब्रह्मा गुरुर् विष्णु गुरुर् देव महेश्वरम गुरुर् साक्षात परम ब्रह्म तस्मय श्री गुरुवे नम तस्मय श्री गुरुवे नम तस्मय श्री गुरुवे नम श्रीमंत हंकर हरि भक्तर जाना जन कल्पतरु तहंत बिनाई नाई 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 अमर परम गुरु अमर परम गुरु अमर परम आज मैं आप लोगों को असम के सत्य नृत्य के बारे में कुछ जानकारी देना चाहता हूं अगर बोलने में कोई भूल हुई तो मुझे क्षमा करे फिफ्टीन सेंचुरी का लास्ट पार्ट और सिक्सटीन सेंचुरी का प्रारंभ में असम में महापुरुष श्रीमंत शंकर देव ने एक शरण हरिनाम धर्म प्रवर्तन किया और इस धर्म को प्रसार करने के लिए महापुरुष श्रीमंत शंकर देव ने गीत वाद्य और नृत्य का भी प्रवर्तन किया इसलिए हमारे असम के वर्गी खोल वैद्य और सत्य नृत्य धर्म से जुड़े हुए हैं इस परंपरा को सत्र नाम के एक स्थान के अनुसार प्रसार करने हेतु इस परंपरा को सत्रिय परंपरा कहा जाता है सत्रिय नृत्य के बारे में बोलने से पहले सत्र क्या है यह जानकारी बहुत ही जरूरी है भगवत पुराण में लिखा है सज्जन त्रयते इति सत्र अर्थात साधु संत लोग और महत लोग जिस जगह पे या जिस स्थान पे मुक्ति या परित्राण ढूंढते हैं उसे ही सत्र कहा जाता है सत्य गीत बद्ध और नृत्य का प्रसार हेतु महापुरुष श्रीमंत शंकर देव के साथ उनके प्रधान शिष्य महापुरुष मारव देव भी स्वामील थे भारतीय शास्त्रीय संगीत नृत्य के अनुसार संपूर्ण ध्रुपदी गुण वैशिष्ट से सत्य गीत वैद्य नृत्य भी महिमा मंदित है महामुनि भरत का नाट्य शास्त्र के अनुसार ध्रुपदी या मार्गीय गुण संपन्न सत्रिया कला को 
संपूर्ण व्याकरणी और वैज्ञानिक पद्धति से महापुरुष श्रीमंत शंकरदेव ने सारा आसम में प्रसार किया है सत्य नृत्य में प्योर डांस और जो एक्सप्रेशनल पार्ट है जिसको भवश्रे नृत्य कहा जाता है उसका जो भंडार है ये बहुत बड़ा है हमारे नृत्य के साहित्य और हस्त का भंडार भी बहुत बड़ा है श्रीमंत शंकरदेव और श्री श्री माधवदेव का यह रसना या साहित्य सत्य नृत्य में व्यवहार होते हैं सत्य नृत्य का जो हस्त का प्रयोग होता है ये हमारे अपना शास्त्र श्री हस्त मुक्तबल ग्रंथ से होता है शुभंकर को भी इस ग्रंथ का रसयिता है डांस इज ए लिविंग ट्रेडिशन सिंस सिक्स हंड्रेड इयर्स बेट द डांस फॉर्म वॉज रिकोगनाइज एज ए मेजर इंडियन डांस फॉर्म बाय संगीत नाटक अकादमी ऑन फिफ्टीन नवंबर इन द ईयर टू थाउजेंड Oh no. 
Vaya 
Thank you. 